everyone, welcome back to Emo Lancer. I am your host, Mike Cheater Lap. Now I'm gonna start as many episodes as I can with that. Alright, we gotta meet King. There you are. I was starting to wonder if you were really okay. You are okay, aren't you? Yeah, I'm fine. Good. So what was going on down there? Who's Lonigan? I met him on Freeport 7. We just signed a deal when the station was attacked. He was injured and has been in medical ever since. I've been waiting for him to recover to get my money back. And? What did he say? Nothing about the money. He said he escaped from medical and that people were after him. I thought he'd lost it, but then these two guys appeared and shot him. Maybe he wasn't just paranoid. <sighs> I'm never getting paid. Goodbye, million credits. Our flight path takes us right past Fort Bush and straight onto the Colorado Gate. You first, Trenton. Hold on, we're almost at the trade lane. Activation sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. I could drop countermeasures now. Forgot what the key for that is. Probably C. I guess so, because it just it pooped when I pressed it. Or maybe E. And I'll I'll try to press C when I get out of the trade lane. It's only a short run from here to the Colorado gate. Let's go. It's faster just to use thrusters here. I mean he'll use them too, so who cares? Activation sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. Ever since the attack on Schultzky, the Navy has moved heavy battleships to all jump gates. Every ship going in or out of the New York system is being scanned. Battleship Unity. I hate that engine. This is jump gate control on Battleship Unity. Please identify yourselves. Over. Unity, this is Patrol Gamma 6 on special LSF assignment. Requesting permission to jump to Colorado. Over. Patrol Gamma 6, you're clear to proceed. Over. Roger that. Gamma 6 out. That wasn't too bad. Let's go. Dark. Dark. Good. Next stop, the Colorado system. So this is essentially the level transitions of this game. Uh, this is how we go from different systems, and we use the jump, jump gates for this. And the sounds have changed for this somewhat. It's actually kind of cool in the graphics as well. It's like Stargate SG-1 kind of tier shit. System jump successful. All systems show green. Trent, take a position near the trade lane. This is Junie. Ashcroft has been sighted in the Kepler system. We don't know which way he's going, but it looks like he's coming straight at you. Keep your eyes open. Over. Acknowledged. Trent. We have to scan every ship that's coming through. Fly to the waypoint and take up position. Good. Cut your engines. We'll wait here. King, Ashcroft's convoy just entered Colorado. We've set up a trap for him at Pueblo Station. Stay where you are and make sure that none of his men get away. Over. Roger. Trent, stay sharp. Okay, so this is how we basically we just scan a bunch of people. That are coming in. So we can see people have nibonium, whatever the fuck that is. No. Uh, there's a lot of fucking ships here. A convoy. Target the ships and scan their cargo. Yeah, they're okay. Also, if he gets past us, we're dead, so. Holy shit. You got enough? Oh, look, it's Kevin. Got it. Oh, there. I'm going in. Follow me. You are in violation of the Liberty Artifact Code and are under arrest. Cut your engines. Trent, go for his engines. Fuck your engines. Look at this guy. We're gonna combat him. Unfortunately, he's just trying to run. 
It's pretty suspicious. And he's, he's firing upon us again. That will be his greatest error. I don't know how I can really go for his entrance. I only have one mode, which is like shoot, shoot at his ass. The combat is so hard now. It's really hard to aim at things. Oh, by the way, yeah. Okay, we're gonna just dock with this. By the way, I had a music mod in uh, before, but I actually turned it off because it uh, it fucked up the music sometimes. Uh, it was like skipping sometimes, so whatever. The default game music is fine. I can't complain. I like it. Where's Where's Pablo Station? I like these asteroids. This is like, like this fucking game is awesome with shit like this. Oh shit, rogues! Probably where missiles would kind of come in handy. I could kind of just like fire missiles at guys like this. I'm glad I have a fighter though. Fighters are so much more maneuverable. Oh. Let's go target this guy next. It's kind of neat because I could just kind of click them and then target them. Notice, notice a big difference in the fact that. These guys miss me a lot more than they did when I had that fucking huge freighter. As I say that, though, it just know that it would be a million times worse if I didn't have like the, if I had the other ship. All right, let's get this guy. I really like the combat, how it's all floaty. It's like it's like actual ships, you know. That's why it's awesome. All I really have to do though to make them miss me is kind of change direction with my with my afterburners kinda. And like my shields just haven't gone down yet. It's really nice. We're gonna get we're gonna get some good ships though. Throughout the throughout the campaign, though, modded ones and and vanilla ones. I should mention. I should mention this one is a vanilla ship. So the only modded one I've seen so far was on Planet Pittsburgh. Uh, the one that wasn't the Rhino was uh, was modded. King, stop taking my kills. I know you want some of the glory, but fuck off. God. You and you and fucking long neck Juni should just get married. Pew, 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 pew. Oh, there we go. Oh wait, so someone fired a missile at him. Does King have missiles now? 
Yeah, do you see how their health comes- Oh, fuck! That better have not been you, King. I swear to God, King. I know, we have to defend Pablo. I guess there's Mexicans here. Remember how I said there was no, bl like, no black people or no, uh... Well, no brown people either, but... I guess the Asians are still here. Also, one of the ships is called the Hispania, if you remember from the beginning. Yet, there is no Hispania space. So, there's something about that. Yeah. Last one. Pueblo, what's your status? We lost life support to several sections, but we're alright. What happened? We set up a trap for a guy named Ashcroft, but his convoy didn't come out of the train lane as we thought. They came from the Copperton field and totally surprised us. The LSF fighters were taken down like flies. Where are the transports? When the fighting started, they took off into the Silverton field. We tagged one of them with a tracking device. Uploading now. Are you getting the signal? Yes, we are. Strong and clear. Thank you, Pueblo. They will pay for this. Good hunting. Ashcroft is ours. Trent, head for the coordinates. Man. You, got, you guys want me to do this, right? No, I... I fuck it. It's making me sick, too. <laughs> King, what is going on? Where's Ashcroft? We're on his tail. Pueblo managed to tag one of Ashcroft's ships. We're following the signal into the Silverton field. We can use some help. Understood. I'm ordering the Rio Grande to send several fighter wings. Don't do anything foolish, King. Wait for the support. Judy out. Gamma 6, this is Navy Patrol Zeta 1. Proceeding to your location. Over. Fucking asteroids. There they are. Ashcroft and his thugs. This must be the drop-off point for the artifacts. This is LSF Gamma 6. We found Ashcroft. Need immediate backup. Lock onto my signal. Over. Ignore the transports, Trent. We have to take out the fighters. Gamma 6, this is Patrol Zeta 1. Ready to engage. Good to see you, Zeta 1. We're looking for a criminal named Ashcroft. We need him alive. Acknowledged. This is Zeta Leader. Engage rogue fighters. I want the silver. Is it silver? What? Why does the tractor keep failing? Whatever. Alright, let's go find something to kill. I, I guess I should restore my shield. Now, normally with the ships, I would want to get something like a something with a missile. We're gonna do some interesting combinations of ships though throughout the LP. Uh, so there'll be plenty of time for that. Right now, this is a more of a pew pew ship, so that's why we're doing pew pew. Uh, I, I, this will not be the last. I, I, I will do combat freighter again, I'm sure. Fuck, what do I have in my inventory? Fucking tons of these things. I mean, silver is fucking. What the hell, silver? Just looking at. Silver weighs a lot. I, and then again, you know, I'm not surprised either. I was just kind of wondering what the hell I had that was that heavy. But it was silver, so... I can jettison some of those things and so I can equip something, like, better, but whatever. It actually, things actually have space now. What's our objective right now? Destroy enemy rogues, alright. I could do that. You know, okay, by the way, every time I kill something, I hear I hear Trent going, huh. Like it's very faint, but it's not the only time I've heard it that now, and now I'm suspicious. Oh, come on, this, you're dead. There you go. And a tractor fail. All units, I found Ashcroft. 
He's fleeing into the field. I've tagged him. Trent, we can't let him get away. Come on. Damn it. Ashcross making a run for it. He activated his cruise engines. No. Firing cruise disruptor. Damn. The disruptor missile missed Ashcroft. He's entered cruise speed. We have to hurry before he can get away. Activate your cruise engines and head for the coordinates. We are, we are so gonna give fucking Ash, Ashcroft an ass whooping. Also, he was already like 10k away, and I totally didn't see a, a him fire a cruise missile at all. Also, that's a jump hole right there. I, it's, I'm surprised I can even see that. They aren't really accessible in the story, uh, unless you do certain story missions. Not all of them are accessible, as you mentioned. Yeah, we're, we're going away from the base, so we're mainly just after Ashcroft. Yeah, fucking jump hole, what the hell? Things have a really long draw distance in this game. It's kind of neat. I'm picking up a disturbance. Could be a jump hole. We have to hurry or he's gonna get away. I'm picking something up on my scanners. Roger that. I'm seeing the same thing. Everybody? Get ready. You'll be sorry you ever met me. What kind of disturbance are you reading on your sensors? Whatever. By the way, I really like the music of this game. It's very atmospheric, should I say. This guy has like tons of shield things. Look at this asshole with his fucking shield things. I could do the, I could do that too though. You're not the only one who has infinite shields. I'm gonna kill this asshole. There's really no point in using encounter measures right now because nothing, nothing, nothing right now fires misses at me. You've heard you've heard the, 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 the noise once before. Okay, I take it back. I'm really glad I didn't bring a freighter with me. Cause fucking hell, I, I'm still getting my ass kicked here. Stop. You need me alive. No I don't. I think he's shooting mines at me. Like that's that's why I keep killing by accident. Your friends really fucking love me. This guy's such a pain in the ass. Maybe I should have saved him for last. Fucking hate him. He's got like infinite health. That. He's ejected. Trent, use your tractor beam to bring him in. Alright, let's go. Did I not do that? Tractor. Where the hell is he? Oh shit! <laughs> he took some damage apparently. Okay, I got it. Zeta 1, we're taking Ashcroft back to New York for interrogation. Thanks for your help. Don't mention it. Good job, Trent. Ashcroft's on ice and Junie's waiting for us in New York. I'm uploading a waypoint to the gate. Let's get going. I hope Ashcroft's interrogation will shed some light on the illegal artifact trade here in Liberty. Pressure from high up has been mounting in the last few weeks. Rumor has it that about a month ago, a Rhineland expedition discovered a whole new supply of these things on a distant planet in the Omicron systems. I mean, everybody knows that there are alien ruins, but they're mostly dust, and the artifacts are just as dead as the beings who made them. Apparently, these new ones are different. They're active, and could be dangerous. Both LSF and the Liberty Navy have stepped up their patrols, and I've heard rumors within the LSF that the President will soon be banning these artifacts altogether.
All right, well, we're just gonna head back to the, the jump hole. The hole for jumping. It, these missions actually do take a while. Like this one, this one's taken like already 20 minutes. So these are, these are still really long. Ashcross little party. He was getting ready to move those artifacts out of the black market when we took him down. You didn't kill him, did you? I remember the last time. Negative. Trent has him tied up in his cargo hold. He deserves worse. He'll get what he deserves, but not until he's told us all we need to know. I'll make preparations for your arrival. Be careful heading back to New York. Intel advises that members of Ashcroft's gang might try to free him before we get him into lockdown. I'm still on Manhattan. Meet me there. Junie out. I'm surprised the dialogue continued even though I did that awesome fucking spin into the, the jump gate. I have all the right moves. This is jump gate control on the battleship Unity. Please identify yourselves. Over. This is Patrol Gamma 6 on special assignment. We have a prisoner for the LSF. Requesting permission to proceed. Over. Acknowledge, Gamma 6. You've received priority clearance. Over. Thank you, Unity. Out. Junie must have arranged that for us. Let's go. This is Junie. Change of plans. You and Trent are to proceed directly to the battleship Missouri near Zone 21. I'll take charge of Ashcroft there. Junie out. The Missouri? She's full of surprises. Usually the Navy draws the lines at Zone 21. They must really want to get their hands on Ashcroft. We're almost there. One more trade lane. Which one? What the fuck, King? Trent, dock with the trade lane to proceed. What the fuck, King? You're so slow. There he comes. We can watch him and then shoot him a little bit. Oh, here we go. There's rogues. Damn it. Intel was right. More rogues! Trent, we have to fight them off. Fort Bush, this is LSF Gamma 6. We're under attack and need assistance. Over. This is Fort Bush. We're launching two wings to assist you. Fort Bush Wing Alpha here. Engaging enemy. That's when you thought the combat was over. It's not. It'll never end. I have no shield batteries, by the way. I used them all in the last mission. Basically, when you first start a new mission, you really want to kind of stockpile on those. It, it would appear. And also, I should, probably should be smarter about my combat, because I took a lot of damage when I was fighting Ashcroft. You go get Danny. Denny. Denny E Wing. Kind of like reading the names. This guy's complaining that I'm on his ass. Luckily, his ship is far better than what I had before. Oh, it's like all crap now. I don't really want any of this stuff. Alright, let's go get this guy. Michael North! Hopefully there's- I'm not leaving anything good behind here. I really want the silver. They actually made uh, cargo space mean something. It, d it actually really didn't in the original game. Like, bring your fighter out wasn't a big deal. You could, you could bring generally all the cargo back with you. I noticed that with the drugs as well. The drugs take up more space. Last one! That was close. Thank you, Alpha Wing. Don't mention it, Gamma 6. This way, Trent. Junie's waiting. I like Fort Bush. That's a nice fort. For the rogues to attack is so close to Fort Bush. Ashcroft must really know something important. Yeah, we're almost there. Actually, we haven't been here yet. You guys haven't seen this battleship. It's actually pretty neat, the battleships in this game. 
You know, you can even mod the game. I once had a mod where I flew the Battlestar Galactica. It was, it was good times, I'll tell you that much. I like that mod. on special LSF assignment. We're bringing a prisoner to LSF Commander Junko Zane. Over. Acknowledged. Commander Zane is awaiting you. Over. Roger that. Gamma 6 out. Time to collect your credits, Trent. Hold on. Yeah, I understand. Yes, I'm leaving right now. Over. Okay, he's just going somewhere else. Don't worry about it. Are you sure you brought enough men? He's unconscious in my cargo hold. Trent. Ashcroft is a dangerous man, and I don't like to take unnecessary risks. Which reminds me, the bounty. And I owe you the access codes. They're both being uploaded to your Neuronet now. You'll also find an extra bonus. Thanks. You did a good job. You deserve it. What's gonna happen to Ashcroft? He'll be interrogated, of course. He's our best insight into the smuggling ring. I'm sure we can make him talk. Meanwhile, with your new security status, I suspect you'll be able to occupy your time while I'm gone. Where are you going? On assignment. I take orders too, Trent. But don't go too far. I might need you again. Soon. Alright, uh, let's go see. We got a repair. bunch of stuff we can go repair. Uh, we got the drills. Oh, there's we got Raphael. Uh, that's my favorite fucking uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, or Raphael. Um, really, nothing else I want here. Typically, I don't know when I got these. I must have picked it up from those ships that I was killing all the time. And here we have the Stalker missile, as well as uh, so these missiles differ. Like here's like I'll show you the differences. Like these are all class one missiles, so they're like the lowest tier of missiles possible. But they have like hull damage per shot. So this one has a, a, a range of a thousand meters. Uh, projectile speed is it's kind of slow, but and the refire rate and turn rate are kind of like whatever. Um, like you can see the differences. I'm just trying to look at the differences. So the refire rate on this is slow, so you can't fire it that often. The eraser missile does a whole lot of shield damage, but like basically nothing for hull damage. And and that's and it has a really good refire rate, so you can just keep you can just spam those. Stalker missile opposed to the javelin missile, though, um, the, the the turn rate on the stalker missile is like double that, so it will usually hit, uh, and also it fires twice as fast, um, but it does half the damage. So you know, those are the, the there's upsides and downsides, you know, kind of to this stuff. I'm not even going to use that fucking missile thing. Ja fuck the javelin missile. And I guess there's really nothing else I want here. Uh, I guess I should buy some more shield batteries, though. We do, we, we do have the option to buy a, a ship here. Uh, what is this ship? It's a Defender Heavy Fighter. Uh, and it's got like one turret. Uh, the best of the best. Maximum weapon class is two. So, eh, I can do that. So. Oh, this is actually worse, I think, than this ship. Because this one has more armor and the same amount of cargo space. Yeah, yeah, mine is better actually. This one technically does have more weapon slots, but that's kind of interesting. I may, I may have, I, I may have been able to take that out with me, but I didn't. So, all right, let's go sell my escape pods and polymers sell for a lot in Plant Pittsburgh, so we're not going to bother with that. Silver, that's fine. Water, yeah, whatever. I don't care. It's not a lot of money. Okay, it's artifacts. A lot of money for these and oxygen. There's, there's meds, and then there's more silver here. Alright, well, I guess that's all the time we got for today. Let's go check out the bar. You can also see the news. All the news that's fit uh, for you. Welcome this to Crossfire. The fuck? I, I don't really understand this. Ujnovada quest, whatever. Okay. There's really nothing interesting here for these missions, so. that's. I guess we'll go, so see you later. Bye.